Oh, come on, baby. You know who it is. You know what it is. And you know it's about to go down. This is J-Rock. And J-Rock is here to react to Death Stranding. But before I get into that, just real quick, J-Rock, just want to let you know, I appreciate all your support. For those of you who are supported already, just want to let you know, when I get to 100 subscribers, I will be start doing a random giveaway of a gift certificate or gift card on my channel. In order to be a part of that, you got to do two things. You got to subscribe to my channel and you got to be commenting on my videos because I'm going to go through the comment section to determine who is going to be the winner. It's going to be completely random. Um, I'll let you guys know more about it as we get closer, more and more to that goal. But right now, let's check out some Death Stranding. What J Rock is cooking? Finally, J Rock has come back to you too. What is happening in 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 with the millions? of J-Rock's fans, baby. We are here to check out Death Stranding. How to make Death Stranding less of a walking simulator. I got something to say about this game once we're done checking this out, but let's check it out and see, okay? Hey everyone. Welcome to Zipline Simulator. That's right. Death Stranding is a video game where you're walking, a, you do a lot of walking. Or Running. you do a lot of building and make it where you never have to walk again. That's not entirely true. You still have to walk to the zip lines. But let me show you how this works. I know what you're going to say, Mark. Why is there blurs on your screen? Because of spoilers. There's some spoilery stuff that I can't not have on my screen. So there's going to be some, some blurs or some stuff there. It's going to make it where you can't read it. Here I am in Capital Not City. And I need to go over somewhere. Let's say here. That's a long walk. Or a short zip line. Look at all my zip lines. Actually, a lot of these are online zip lines. Okay, let's take a delivery. Okay, we're going to go to the way station west of Capital Not City. And we're going to take all this stuff. 130 kilograms. Oh my, oh jeez. I can't carry it all. Uh, there we go. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be easy. Look at all this I have to carry. That's crazy. If you're a person that doesn't like to do a lot of walking, then this is gonna be for you. Because the walking that you're seeing me do now, it's almost over. Alright, here's our first zip line. Let's go for a little ride. Oh, okay. Look at him. BB, he, he loves it. He loves it. <laughs> it's also a great BB way clapping. to raise your uh, bond with BB because he, he loves the zip lines. You get to fly past the B team. Look at this. This was a game wow. where we once had to walk all of this. And now we get to just sit here and, and do nothing. Yeah, but you still got to walk all that way to put them up, don't you? Unless somebody else does it. And here we are. We did it. That was, uh, that was quite the journey. I think it took us, like, a minute. Let's go, let's go do this delivery. Hey, man. How's it going? Got some packages for you. Yes, there I you go. go. Here's everything. It should, you should all be in perfect condition. JTS, sir, and how are yes. you this afternoon? All righty then. I, I have a package for you. Here you go. Those are my Hello. my Ace Ventura fans out there. 
Most likely, sir. I bet you it was something oh, that somebody language. language. Wait, what do you say? Perfect. Of course it was. I bet it was something nice, though. Ah, shut up with your boss. I don't care about the boss. Here and here boss we'll sucks. Look at these. Out to you, sir. The boss don't, don't even use zip lines. Okay, okay so, so that, that was that was an easy one. one. That, that was just there to there. But let's say we need to go all the way to Port Knot City. No, let's do the wind farm. We'll do the wind farm first. Let's see if I have a delivery that needs to go to the wind farm. Oh, we have two deliveries. Let's do them both. And we're going to do premium deliveries. All right, to the wind farm. See you, buddy. I'm out of here. Have a good one. All right, okay, I'll be careful. People really like that trigger song. That's the only song they put on these things. To the wind farm! Wow, and that stays on your back. Stays on your back the whole time, right? That looks fun, man. For this part, I, I gotta do a little bit of a disclaimer. Uh, there's a lot of trees, so I have to get a little creative on how these zip lines go. But it's it's pretty good, and it still works. Man. I, I can't even lie, that looks hot. I can't even lie. That looks hot right there. So that looks hot right there. Still took a little bit of a uh, little bit of time fall damage. Yeah. That rain kills your equipment. Perfect. Good as new. Hey guys, I'm here. Here you go. Here's some pristine packages in record breaking time. I'm the best. I walked all the way here. Give me lots of likes. And pristine deliveries for all. Perfect. Yeah. So that's uh, that's pretty much it. I went through and I like five star all these areas in like an hour because it's uh, it's like ridiculously easy once you just zip line everywhere. I know. It's like isn't it boring? Just zip lining everywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is, but it's, it's, uh, it helps. Helps, helps get, get through the game fast. fast. Ooh, that's a cool looking car. Who made this car? Ooh, ooh, what? Bit C Bond go. That's a cool car. So yeah, that's it. That's, uh, that's how to, uh, get through this first region super fast. It's fun to try to build all these things. I actually enjoyed the little bit of a puzzle that it was to try to figure out how to get all the zip lines everywhere. Because uh, the biggest obstacle you're going to face is that uh, each zip line takes 500 chiral network, and you start pushing up against that pretty quickly. Once you start building all your zip lines, the tips are uh, plant line and utilize other people's zip lines so that way you don't have to build every single one. And then kind of saying. go through and flush out the gaps like like this one probably wouldn't be able to reach to this one so i put one here and now there's a, a full network and yeah you can see it uh, pretty much can go anywhere uh i won't show you the second map it's just because there's tons of spoilers there and it's, it's not worth trying to blur everything uh it's a it's a little bit harder on the second map because it's way bigger uh but that one you get to utilize freeways so uh it's it's the it's a it's about the same deal that's it. Thanks for watching the first ever gameplay. So here's what I got to say about this game. Death Stranding. When I first saw the trailers and everything about this, I wasn't quite sure what to think about the game because I didn't really know what it was about. Didn't make sense. And then as more and more trailers come out, my interest in the game just became less and less. Only because the story, the, the point of the game, didn't make sense to me. However, J-Rock says this. I have been watching some gameplay over the last several days of this game. 
uh, some walkthroughs. Um, yeah, it's a lot of walking. Eventually, you get a motorcycle at some point. Um, the the storyline doesn't still doesn't make sense, but the mechanics of the game are starting to become more clear to me. And so, with that said, uh, yesterday, J Rock made the decision, and J Rock added Death Stranding to his Game Fly video game queue. So, in so many words, I'll be playing this game. Never thought I would, but I kept an open mind. See what happens when you keep an open mind? You might be opened up to a new world you weren't even aware that existed. Um, so, if I like it, I might keep it. If I don't like it, I send it back, get another video game, no harm done. But, uh, this game was starting to pique my interest. Like I said, the storyline, nah, I don't know. But the mechanics, gameplay of it, uh, there's, I saw somebody who was up in the mountains or somewhere on the, on, on the mountains and they were snowboarding. I was like, wow, that looks fun. So there are different things about this game that are starting to be revealed as you play it. Um, I mean, still at the end of the day, you're nothing more than a, a glorified FedEx guy delivering packages everywhere. But the journey in doing so, I guess, is what makes it interesting. You know, how you have to keep everything together, uh, how you have to watch out for the BTs. And now we just saw a way that you can set up zip lines, or if you're online, you can use other people's zip lines, which once I do get it, I'll probably be doing that. Uh, consider considering how it'll be some time would have gone by since, you know, the game came out and I'm playing it. So it'll be a lot more things ready to go once I actually get the game. But I'm going to check it out, see how it is. Um, so stay tuned for my review on that once I get it up and uh, start playing it. But if you appreciate it and enjoy J-Rock's reaction to this video, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe uh, so you can be a part of the 100 subscribers. So you can be a part of the drawing and comment on my videos as well. Uh, I'll be starting that once I get to 100 subscribers. Um, also, um, I'm going to be probably doing something for my Facebook fan page as well. Not sure. Uh, but the link to my Facebook fan page is down below. You got a video you want me to check out? Post it there. And if I choose yours, I'll give you a shout out uh, as well. And also, uh, make sure you hit that bell. So that you can be notified that it is time to be electrified. Join J Rock on his journey to 1 million subscriber, subscribers. The People's Movement uh, is on its way. And uh, J Rock wants you to be a part of it. Alright? Come along for the ride, baby. But until we meet again, wait for it. Wait. <clears throat> if you're smiling. What J-Rock is.